High frequency trading is a recent development in financial markets where trading is being done mainly by computers and the time frame between trades taking place has reduced to milliseconds. It's all being done by algorithms programmed in by computers. Human intervention is not taking place anymore. One of the big concerns about high frequency trading is do they add value to society in terms of allocational efficiency. There have been calls for regulating them because high frequency trading is highly profitable, suggesting that they might be extracting rents from other traders. They are profitable at the expense of other traders. So to make it a level playing field, should we regulate high frequency trading? What we look at is the trading of high frequency traders on macroeconomic news announcements. The reason we look at macroeconomic news announcements is it is a very clean experiment because the timing of the macro announcement is known, the uh, surprise in the macroeconomic announcement is known, and what matters is the speed at which trading takes place. If you trade fast, it will be profitable. If you are a slower trader, you won't be able to take advantage of an announcement. We look at macroeconomic announcements and show that the profitability of the high frequency traders has gone down over time and this profitability has gone down because of competition from other high frequency traders and other liquidity supplying low latency traders. What this suggests is that we should let competition work and let competition take care of this negative externality or the rent seeking by high frequency traders. The regulators have to be very careful when they do want to regulate financial markets, specifically high frequency trading. High frequency traders do bring a lot of benefits to markets in terms of lower volatility, better price discovery. The competition in the high frequency market is taking care of any negative externalities that the high frequency traders impose on other market participants.